today we are going to start this one. Children, today we are going to learn the laws of reflection. Okay, the materials needed. What are the materials needed? Laser light. Where is the laser light? This is the laser light. Okay. Next one, plain mirror. Plain mirror. Next, series one, protractor. Okay. Next. Next one. Two incentive sticks. Two incentive sticks. So who did cut the lamp down? So incentive sticks means laser to see the path of the laser light. We are using this. It's more than one of the things. Kanthi ni manu chuda dan kosam di ni upay vishnu Kanthi ni manu prayana margana chuda dan ki Okay na? Now come to the point What are the laws of reflection? What are the three laws of reflection? The angle of incident is equal to the angle of angle of reflection The incident ray reflected ray lies on either side of the normal Okay The incident ray reflected ray lies on either side The incident ray reflected ray and the normal lies in the same plane Angle of incident is equal to the angle of reflection First, we will verify that. See this. Now, see this. This is the point of incident. Observe this. This is the point of incident. See this one. When the light is incident at 90 degrees, see, the reflected light also gets back. The light reflects in the same direction. So, making an angle of 90 degrees. See this one. So, the angle of incident is 90. Angle of reflection is also 90. When the light incident normally, okay, when the light is incident normally, it gets back along the same angle. It gets back Sorry. along the same angle. Okay. Next, see this one. Now the angle of incident, after this, the angle of incident is 10 degrees. Yes, sir. Okay, this is the incident ray. After this, this is the in After this, this is the incident ray which is making an angle of 10 degrees after this this is 10 degrees this is the point of incident okay so angle of incident is 10 degrees angle of reflection is also 10, 10 degrees. degrees next angle of incident is 20 degrees after this one angle of incident is 20 degrees angle of reflection is also 20, 20 degrees. degrees next angle of incident is 30 degrees after this Angle of incident is 30 degrees. Angle of reflection is also 30 degrees. After this one. You can see the path. Okay. Next one. Next. Angle of incident. 40 degrees. After this one. Angle of incident is 40 degrees. Angle of reflection is also 40 degrees. After this carefully. Okay. This is also 40. Angle of incident is 40. Angle of reflection is also 40. Next, angle of incident is 50 degrees after this. Okay, angle of reflection is also 50, 50 degrees. degrees. Next, angle of incident is 60 degrees. Angle of reflection is also 60, 60 degrees. degrees. You can see the path after this. After this, see this. This is the incident ray. See this. This see. is the incident ray. After this, yes, this is the incident ray. Can you see that? Yes, sir. And this is the reflected ray. This is the reflected ray. So, with this we can conclude that angle of incident is equal to angle of reflection. At the same time, the incident ray, reflected ray and the normal lies in the same plane. The incident ray, reflected ray lies on either side of the normal. Can you see that? Yes, sir. Okay. With this we can show, we proved the laws of reflection. Thank you.